Assalamu alaikum this is Maryam with today's argument Today's topic is expanding CPAC scope with China Pakistan is considered a significant partner in China's Belt and Road initiative and has received substantial Chinese investments in energy and transport infrastructure over the past decade However these investments have primarily focused on physical infrastructure while Pakistan's industry and agriculture sectors have not seen the same level of development. This has led to criticism that Pakistan has not fully benefited from the promise of the China-Pakistan Economic Corridor, a flagship project of the BRI. China recently renewed its commitment to BRI at the third Belt and Road Forum for International Cooperation, offering Pakistan an opportunity to expand economic ties beyond energy and transport projects. Both countries agreed to broaden the scope of CPAC to include industry, mining, agriculture, science and technology, education, and other areas. Additionally, China agreed to finance the upgrade of a rail track from Peshawar to Karachi and invest in Pakistan's refinery business. Historically, various factors including political statements, bureaucratic challenges, slow progress on industrial infrastructure, regulatory issues and external factors like the COVID-19 pandemic and security concerns hindered progress in these areas. China's emphasis on moving from outlining to detailing its economic initiatives shows its commitment to economic multilateralism and globalization. The question now is whether Pakistan is ready to seize the opportunity to fully realize the potential of CPAC cooperation and develop a more diverse and inclusive economy. This was today's argument. Stay connected for more. Take care.